Well, doesn't get any better than that, does it? What a great shot that was from Judd Trump. Look at the cue power here. Never touched the sides. And just overscrewed it. Pink is on. But it's a tough pot. He missed a brown similar to this in one of the earlier frames. But the pink is the ball that gets him to that red. Hasn't missed it this time though. And played it well. As David said, he does need the tough brown. But now so does Selby. This isn't easy though. He's left himself straight on the red. He'd have to screw it back slightly to be on the black. Well, just made sure of the, the red and now, is he gonna play the green? I'll tuck him behind the black. Normally goes to win, Judd Trump. Again, just a little too hard, but he'll be going for it. 11. No, didn't go for it. Surprised, Jump to Trump. but a 11. good safety. Oh, we had an epic battle on the yellow a couple of frames ago. Six points between them here. Both need that brown. What a big swerve this is round the pink. Where's it going to finish? This looks good. Now, doesn't really want to play this at pace. Could bring the brown into play. So I'll just land up to it. Chance of getting the cue ball. In behind the black. Full ball.
Oh, he's caught it too thick. He needs a little rub. And could so easily have left the yellow on there, catching it so thick. But surely he's going to be in trouble next shot. That's a let off. Thought it would have been tight in behind the black there. Yeah, that's very unlike Mark Selby. You, as you say, you put your house on him being wedged in behind the black. He's happy. Again, chance to get that cue ball in behind the black. Push the yellow up next to the brown. And this time he gets it. Would have liked to have brought the brown into play there, and I think that's what he intended. Three ball. Power enemies. Max up before. Three ball. Then I think it'd be going back. Back. I think he's playing this off two cushions, but he could go direct at it. He'd have a chance of potting the yellow. Two cushion escape. And this time he misses it the Mark other missed. side. Before. Still makes no difference to the state of the match, this at uh, the frame. Both players still need that brown. What he doesn't want to do is bring the brown into play. Nope, missed it the other side again. Paul and miss. Mark Salvi, four. And three ball. Well, he's left the yellow on. So it's going to come down to that brown. Well, trying to bring it into play directly. But that is not a bad place to land. He might have another chance to go at the brown here. Oh. Yes, it dropped just about right for Mark Selby there. He needs brown and blue. No. Ooh. Hang on. Wow, so unexpected for Mark Selby to miss that kind of shot. And again, he's dropped a little fortunate, not leaving the brown on. 
frustrating though, having set up the chance, bringing the brown out to then miss it. It's close. Trump just looking for one more chance to put himself in the final. Selby had a chance there to reduce the deficit to 5 3. Oh. Oh. <laughs> and I miss. Trump on four. Well, unusually for Mark Selby, he is a little rattled. You, you got to say it. Been put back in from where the cue ball's finished. He's took a risk here. Tried to cover them. Now, is it going to go dead? No, it isn't. So, easy brown. And pink, not in a good spot for Judd Trump. <laughs> is it hard enough? His body language says not. Well, you called it dead right Joe and uh, you can't, certainly can't see it to pot it amazing all he had to do was get topside well, to be able to see the blue to pot it so three points in it on the blue the two other close frames in this match both won by Mark Selby one on the black one on the pink Well, there have been some very good safety shots in this match from both players, neither giving an inch. And there's another one trying to get in behind the blue, but I don't think there's room. There was, just, and he's played it well. He's got the snooker, I think. That's been a feature, really, that Trump has more than matched Selby in the safety stakes. And has outscored him. Hence, he's in front. He wouldn't have that one over. Excellent escape. And that's just how he played it. Snooker. He didn't play the snooker, but he did play that thin contact on the blue. He's happy. <laughs> Has he got the snooker again? Well, we've been here before in this match. <laughs> <laughs> All sorts of snookers being got from snooker positions. He has got the snooker coming off two cushions. But he's left it on unless it goes dead on the cushion. So surely this time round, Trump will get onto the pink. And that's all he needs, blue and pink, to put himself in the final. He's played the better snooker of the two. He came out right from the start, really going for it at a 1-3-5. And he's always had Selby on the back foot.
Mark Selby at times had looked a little rattled. And he's not easy to rattle. In goes the pink. Judd Trump, the first man into the European Masters final. A good all-round performance from him. He made the breaks. He played some good safety as well. And listen to the ovation. The crowd loved that. And they'll be seeing him tomorrow against either Ronnie O'Sullivan or Neil Robertson. He's won 6-2.